age of Aquarius, the golden age. The frequencies and the, the vibrations around the whole entire planet is off the charts. It is extremely high right now. And we're going into that time period where a lot of people are beginning to see that they've been deceived. If you look at all the old manuscripts, almost every religion believes in a deity, a higher power, a higher consciousness, uh, celestial beings, uh, angels, demons, uh, you name it. It's all been in there. So it's kind of crazy uh, to believe now that uh, we're just now catching up with this or so many people are just now catching up with this. If you believed uh, that we were the only beings in the whole entire universe out of uh, so many trillions of planets, so many trillions of stars and moons and things of that nature. And we are just uh, just special um, in the regards of being the only uh, civilization in the universe. And man, you have been living under a rock. It's easy to uh, pinpoint and say that there are other beings out here, especially when you look at all of the older texts, uh, when you look at the Ethiopian Bible, when you look at the Bible in itself, when you look at the Sumerian tablets, uh, Emerald Tablets of Thoth, um, when you look at the Dead Sea Scrolls, when you look at all these older texts, um, it's telling you that celestial beings have been here the whole entire time and they've been helping the human race. They've been helping human beings. Um, the whole entire time they've they've been here, they've been interacting with human beings. Uh, it just seems like the CIA and uh, the government has been trying to hide it and cover it up um, from the masses. And they've been working with these beings uh, this whole entire time. And we are aware of it now. It's like to speak about an alien in this uh, time frame is 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 like it's not shocking to anybody um, to hear that the Israeli government came out and spoke about Trump knowing about the Galactic Federation and Trump knowing that, you know, uh, about the aliens this whole entire time. I don't think that's a shocker to anybody. I think everybody's response is more so like, well, it's about time that you came out and just told the truth about what was going on. So, and it's a big up to everybody who's been doing uh, the research, who's been putting information out there just to wake people up. Hermann Olberth was a German physicist. He is considered one of the founding fathers of rocketry and astronautics. Hermann made a statement after World War II. Uh, we cannot take credit for our record advancement in certain scientific fields alone. We have been helped. Uh, when asked by who, uh, Hermann stated the people on other worlds. The Book of Enoch also goes into uh, telling us about how aliens and how angels have been helping us from the beginning, helping us form weapons for warfare, teaching us how to pray, uh, teaching us how to make jewelry, teaching us how to do piercings and make clothes and garments and homes. Uh, these angels were basically advancing our civilization. Uh, you've been conditioned from birth as a child not to connect with your higher consciousness. As um, soon as you ask the question, it's going to allow uh, you to attract the answer. And I've said that in past videos, sir. No matter how you get the answer, you are attracting the answer. Man's search for understanding of laws which regulate his life has been unending, yet always just beyond the veil which shields the higher planes from material man's vision. The truth has existed, ready to be assimilated by those who enlarge their vision by turning inward, not outward in their search. So big thanks to Kurt Heckinger, who I just connected with on my spiritual journey. Amazing guy. I gained insight and wisdom just speaking with him. Um, he's having a Reiki Share Circle um, healing event on December 21st, uh, 8 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, it's for any and everyone, but just check it out. The link is in the description. I'm sending out love and light uh, in every direction, man. Be blessed, stay woke, and be calm in storms. Peace.